LED or light emitting diode is an electronic component that is used for lighting. LED has two terminals. The longer side is positive or anode and the smaller side is negative or cathode. When we are using LED in a circuit, we must connect the terminals correctly. This is the symbol for LED that we will use in, in a circuit. This is the data sheet of the LED that I use in this video. Before using a LED in a circuit, we must know two parameters of the LED. The first parameter is the forward current. This is the current that the LED can pass. And the second parameter is the forward voltage or voltage drop across the LED. You can find this data from the data sheet of the LED that you are using. If we connect a LED directly to, power, to a power source, we create a short circuit and the amount of current that passing through this LED is high and the LED will explode. For limiting the current that passing through the LED, we must use a resistor. A resistor is used for reducing the current that going in LED. But we must use the resistor value correctly. If the resistor is too much big, the amount of current that passing through this resistor is small and the LED light is dim. If the resistor value is very small, the amount of current that passing through this resistor is big and the LED will explode. For calculating resistor value for LED, we use Ohm law. Ohm law is resistor equal to voltage divided by current. We have a LED. The forward voltage of LED is 3 volt. The forward current of LED is 0.02 ampere, as we saw in the data sheet of the LED. We have a power supply that is equal to 9 volt, and we want to calculate the resistance of the resistor. For this, we use Ohm law. The resistance is equal to voltage drop across the resistor, that is equal to voltage of power supply minus the forward voltage of the LED and after that divided by the forward current. We know the voltage of power supply that is 9 volt. We know the forward voltage of the LED that is 3 volt. And also we know the forward current of the LED that is 0.02 ampere. Now we can calculate the resistor value. And the resistor value is 300 ohm. 320 ohm is the nearest value of resistance that we can find. Now we calculate the power of the resistor. This is the formula for our calculation of the power. Power is equal to current square multiplied by resistance. We know the current that is 0.02 ampere and also we, now we know the resistance value that is 320 ohm. Now we calculate the power of resistor that is equal to 12.8 milliwatt. As you know, we have different power rating of resistors. As the power, as the power is less, we can use quarter of watt resistor for our circuit. And this is the formula for calculating the total power of the circuit. The total power of the circuit is equal to current multiplied by the voltage. As the current is 0.02 ampere and the voltage that is the voltage of power supply is 9 volt, the total power of the circuit is 18 milliwatt. Now we use a resistor of 320 ohm resistance in the circuit. As you can see, now the LED is working fine how we can calculate resistor value for series of LEDs. For calculation of resistor value for series of LEDs, again we use Ohm law. This is the formula for calculation of resistor value for series of LEDs.
first we need to calculate the voltage across the resistor Vs that is the voltage of power supply that is 9 volt minus the sum of the voltage forward voltage of diodes that here the forward voltage of diode 1 that is 3 volt plus the forward voltage of diode 2 that is 3 volt and this is the forward current that the forward current here is 0 0.02 ampere now we can calculate the resistor value and the resistor value for a series of LEDs that here is 2 is 150 ohm this is the formula for calculation of power of resistor the power of resistor is 6 milliwatt and we can select from resistor power rating of half quarter of watt and this is the formula for calculation of total power of circuit and the total power of the circuit is equal to 18 milliwatt now you can use the resistor in the circuit as you can see the circuit is working now we have parallel LEDs the best option for parallel LED is that using a resistor for every LED here we have two LED as you can see for each LED we use a resistor for example here we have a red LED that the forward voltage is 3 volt and the forward current is 0 0.02 ampere the calculation of resistor for this LED is the same as before as you can see in the picture we use the same formula and uh, the supply voltage minus the forward voltage divided by the forward current that the result is 300 ohm that the resistor we can use is 320 ohm the formula for calculating resistor for second LED is the same as the first one if we have a third fourth all use the same formula but here for here for second LED we use a different LED from the first one here we use a green LED that the forward voltage is different from the first one here the for, forward voltage is 3.5 and the forward current is 0 0.02 the forward current is the same as the first LED we put this value in the formula and the resistance value for the second LED is 100 75 ohm that we can find 165 ohm resistance in the market now you can put the resistor in the circuit as you can see the circuit work and you can see the blue and green LED now you can make your circuit Thanks for watching and if you find this video helpful, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe.